I'm not going to hide it. There's a lot of stuff about Windows 11 that I don't like. Whether it's the center mounted default start menu or the animations or all the cosmetic stuff, there's just a lot of stuff I don't like. But there's one thing I absolutely hate, and that is the fact that they took away the Windows 10 context menu and now we're left with this, where we have to click show more options to see the things we used to see every day. But the good news is, is there's a quick way to fix it and restore it back to the way it used to be. Hey everyone, my name is Scott Merrill. I've been in IT for almost 35 years now, and what I do on this channel is Windows tips, tricks, reviews, troubleshooting, and more. So if that's the kind of thing you're into, make sure you check out my video library because I got a ton of content in there that you might enjoy. Additionally, one of the things that I offer on this channel is PC suggestions for those of you who are looking for a new computer, but you're really not sure what to buy. There is a link in the description for a PC recommendation form. If you fill that out and send it to me, I will laser focus and find you exactly the computer you're looking for on your budget. 100% free. I'm happy to do it. Now, one more quick thing. If you are watching this content on TikTok, please know it is stolen content. Someone has uploaded all of my videos to a channel on TikTok. They're getting all the views and all the revenue from it. I have nothing to do with it. So please don't comment on those videos and expect me to answer because I won't see them. Now that we got that out of the way, one of the things that I wanted to do was create a series of videos that you guys could watch that are quick fixes and also answers to your most commonly asked questions. I'm going to call it five minute Fridays and hopefully I'll be able to upload one every Friday going forward so it'll be something for you to look forward to that you can easily digest. Let's start the timer and let's see if we can get this one knocked out in under five minutes. So as you can see here when I right click on anything I get all of this crap up here. Cut, copy, rename, delete. I don't want those icons. All I want is my old cut and copy and stuff on my menu. Now I can get that by clicking on show more options and there it is the entire thing including all my send to items and everything like that that i use on a daily basis to be fair you can hold down shift and right click on any item and it will automatically do that but you have to remember to hold down shift otherwise you won't get it so what i want to do is make it to where i don't have to hold down shift to get this option the good news is it's super easy all you have to do in your search box is type in cmd and then click run as administrator now there's a registry string that you need to enter here and for simplicity i'm going to put it down in the video description so all you have to do is literally copy that to your clipboard open command prompt and then paste it in in this case i'm going to hit Control v which is pasting that whole string in there and you'll see it's got a registry key here it's adding this key into the registry now once you've got that pasted you simply hit enter on your keyboard you'll see it says the operation completed successfully and now you can close this command prompt if you look now nothing changed and that's because we have to restart your explorer in order for this to take effect super easy let me show you how to do it just right click on your taskbar and go to task manager now you're going to get a list here underneath apps and if you don't see it under apps go under background processes but if you have explorer open it will be here under apps simply right click on windows explorer and select restart and you'll see the screen's going to blink for a second that's okay if you look back here explorer is not in the list now so i'm going to close this and open up explorer again I'm going to go back to that folder I was just working on and when I right click now you'll see it automatically gives me that old menu again. That is awesome. That is exactly what I want. I don't want to ever click show more options again. And it's the same on the desktop. Whatever options you have for desktop you don't have to click show more options. It's just going to automatically do that. That's it. You're done. Now be aware at some point Microsoft may make a change with a newer version of Windows that might keep you from being able to do this. But I've been doing this for a while and it hasn't changed yet. And I don't anticipate they're going to do it because it is just a registry setting. So I hope you found value in this. If you did, make sure you let me know down in the comments below that you enjoy 5 Minute Fridays and I'll make more content. And if you don't, this may very well be the only other one. Also, we're about to hit 300,000 subscribers thanks to you guys. So if you are one of the 80 plus percent people who watch my videos and don't subscribe, it would mean the world to me if you just click that subscribe button and join the community. We'd love to have you. As always, thank you so much for watching and we'll see you in the next video.